62 years of Catholic Scouting were celebrated last weekend as both Boy and Girl Scouts from across the Diocese of Springfield attended the annual Scouting Mass. There were awards bestowed to accompany previously earned medals, patches, and badges. Springfield Bishop Mitchell Rosansky celebrated the special Mass at St. Michael's Cathedral, and as John Thornton tells us, there were plenty of honors all around. On Sunday, November 6th, St. Michael's Cathedral in Springfield hosted the 62nd Annual Catholic Scouting Awards. Boy and Girl Scouts, as well as adult leaders from across the Diocese of Springfield, filled the halls to receive their awards. Overall, 10 Scouts and 3 adult leaders were recognized for their achievements. Springfield Bishop Mitchell T. Rosansky celebrated the special Mass. He explained what this event meant to him. It was wonderful to bestow uh, the awards, the Adaltari Dei Awards, the Pius XII Award, uh, to the adults, the St. Anne's Medal and the St. George's Award for those adults who have served scouting in an exemplary way. And as we gathered around for Mass, we also reflected on how much scouting reflects our Catholic values in life, the ability to appreciate God's presence in nature, to look out for the other, to look beyond oneself and see really how God puts our gifts to use, not only for us, but for others. And those are the, really the virtues that we find in scouting. In attendance was James Perkins, Assistant Scoutmaster of Troop 275 in East Long Meadow. He said what role he believes faith plays in the lives of scouts. Faith is very important. They, you know, they just like tonight's service and the receiving the badges and, and showing that the boys have their faith and they work towards the badges, but they, through the scouting, we encourage them to, to be a part of their community as well as their parishes and, and to reach out. Trish Pylon is a Girl Scout leader and organizer of the annual Catholic retreat for the diocese, which is held every September at Camp Holy Cross in Goshen. She said what working with scouts means to her. Every day is rewarding. I, I'm, I'm learning things from them that I never envisioned by myself as an adult. It's offering me a new faith uh, and new rewards that I never anticipated. And it's like a renewal. Every time we get them together, it's almost like a renewal in my faith because it's, it's very uplifting for me and very positive. The, the children themselves, they are so willing and so giving of themselves. And it always amazes me how we have so many youngsters in our scouting core group who are involved with so many different things within the diocese, and yet they're still willing to, willing to give up more of their time to come and put this retreat together. That, to me, amazes me. Six scouts received the Ad Alter Day Award. Two scouts received the Pope Pius XII Award. One scout received the Pillars of Faith Award. And two scouts received the very special Father Bob Choquette Award. Trish Pylon offered advice for parents and students who are interested in scouting. They could contact their local councils, whether it be Girl Scouts or Boy Scouts, and um, ask to speak to a representative from their area or their district. Uh, and um, there are websites for both of them where you can log on and get that information as well as finding them in the uh, 411 directory. In Springfield, I'm John Thornton.